Welcome back to Ranch Simulator, everybody. Welcome back to a very, very special episode. This is episode five of my season two playthrough. And we're looking at our cheese processing room that we finished in the last episode. And down here, I've added some cows to fill this out so that we have a cow per pen. So we now have six cows over here uh, to milk. And we have the bull. And we have another cow over here, and I'm keeping this cow over here with this bull for breeding. I want to play with that. That was a comment that was uh, suggested to me, and I enjoy comments, and I like to implement comments into my playthroughs if I can. This cow is still not pregnant, uh, so I don't know what goes on between the breeding of the uh, cows uh, you know, like the way the pigs are. The pigs seem to just breed quickly. Uh, but they're only a fence apart and still nothing. Thank you so much for joining me, everybody. Today is a special, special episode because I have... I, I, I'm a little speechless. I am... I am... Uh, I am emotional, I gotta tell you, because I have been given a gift that, that I, I just am overwhelmed with. And the gift of endorsement from... Brito, the home of everything simulation. Brito has been more than generous and kind to this channel, and I cannot tell you how thrilled I am, and I'm sorry, I'm getting a little emotional, uh, but uh, the subscribers that I have gotten in the last day, I, I can't, I can't even fathom it, and I'm sorry, I need to compose myself. Uh, but thank you, Brito. I don't know how I'll ever repay you, and I don't think I can, but you guys have been awesome. Not just Brito, but all of you guys giving me permission to make videos on YouTube is something I can't thank you enough for, and I'm sorry, but this is how it is. Let's get into uh, third person here. I'm going to try to get my uh, shit together, and this is the last time you'll ever hear me swear on my channel. So, I've got cows. And uh, here's how this works. So we've got six cows. And uh, with six cows, we'll get two full containers of milk. So if we added three cows uh, per pen, we would literally have a, con uh, a full container of milk per cow. So this could, this could produce, if one wanted to, uh, let's see, we have, what, 12? Yeah, so... 12 containers of milk every single day uh, to run into cheese. And I've got some cheese going here. Let's take a look. Uh, they still have some time to go. But uh, I think I've already milked these cows, guys. So I might have kind of blown it starting the video at 11 o'clock in the morning. Let me see. I think this cow's already been milked. Yeah, there's nothing coming out. Uh, but basically, this one milk machine will hit all three of these cows and all three uh, cows that will be in here, hopefully. And then, of course, the same thing over here reaches all three and all three. So two milking machines and whatever you need for uh, containers. We'll see. You know, I mean, it's going it, to they're, they're going to grow. So the other the other part of this that I'm, I'm interested in seeing is if this bull will mate and we get uh, cows to fill out the rest of this side uh, for free. And we'll, you know, obviously we'll have to process the males or maybe we'll just sell them, you know, just sell them. I think you can sell live animals in the game. I've never done that before, but I think I've heard that on other channels that they've sold the, uh, the livestock. Okay, so the dairy's done. I mean, it's, you know, it's working. It's going to get us up and going we're going to be able to make money so we've got our cheese going in here i think i've got cheese in all of these yeah all right so basically you can knock out 12 at a time here next thing we need eggs for the cheese so we need to get the cheese uh upgraded by building our chicken coop so the chicken coop needs 52 metal and 100 wood planks. And what I've done is I've gone ahead. Uh, if you remember in the episodes uh, prior, we had the flatbed here full of logs. These are the logs. We have 100 logs 
I'm, I'm sorry, we have 100 planks now. They were logs, now they're planks. We have 100 planks uh, completely ready to go to throw into here. All I need is 52 metal. Let's take a walk onto the, uh, the front end of the ranch. Over here in my little uh, hobo hut where I sleep. I've got three of these going now and I have sold 10 of these now and that's $3,000. So there's good money in honey. No pun intended, but there is good money in honey. What do we got here? We got 42 and six, so that's 48. What, what it said, we need 52. So we're gonna have to go buy, let's see if we got any money left. They did buy those cows, hit the right menu. Yeah, I'm really, really low on funds, so I think what I'm going to have to do, I don't, I'm not going to be able to buy the metal uh, yet. <laughs> uh, that'll break me. I really should have thought of that. I didn't. I was excited to get on and press the record button and uh, get this video out to you guys. But we have other ways of making money. We just need a little metal. So I do have this honey right here. Let's go see if the bees have generated anything else. They're at 50%, 40%, uh, 40%. I could extract this and fill up a couple of more jugs. Two, three, four, five. So if 3,000 is 10, five will be 1,500. We'll go sell these five and we will get the money that we need to build the chicken coop. And that's what we're going to do in this episode. We're going to get the chicken coop built and we're going to start uh, introducing chickens into the mix because we need their eggs. I hope everybody's having a good day. Uh, like I said, my day has been <laughs> extraordinary to say the least. Uh, I think we're sitting at 700 subs right now, uh, which is amazing. And uh, yeah, so yeah, at work today, I've been like a mess. <laughs> you know what I mean? I mean, just a total mess. All right, so what do we got here? I got to take my little gas friend here. I always have a little, uh, oh, that one fell off. That's why. Okay, I always have, have a little gas can on there, a little extra fuel. Keeps me going. Get my uh, Xbox controller. That's how I like to drive. That's what I like about the game, though, that you can switch back and forth. Because uh, I definitely prefer driving with my little Xbox controller. I'm curious as how the farm equipment is going to, uh, uh, to operate. And that's why I cleared the trees over here, guys. I left trees. I'll turn around and, and just steal a little time here. I left these trees so that they're, you know, aesthetically with the ranch. And I, I didn't care if I stripped this down because I want it kind of looking like farmland where I can set up maybe some buildings and stuff over here that does farming stuff. I don't know. I haven't thought about it. And it's easier to shoot these deer. <laughs> There's nothing in the way. All right, let's get over. I think I'm going to go down here to... Uh, what you call it, the place where you uh, sell the meat, the burger place, see if they'll buy honey. I know I can sell it at the general store. I got 3,000 at the general store. Let's see if uh, this, uh, look at all these deer. Deer everywhere. All right, let's see if these sell for the same. I don't know, I've never sold it here. Do, can I even sell it? Do they? Do they ever want honey here? Let's find out. Oh, yeah, they'll take it. Yeah, it's the same price. So we'll get $1,500. It's just shorter to uh, travel here and sell it than uh, head over to the general store. Plus, we need to go to the hardware store. We're going to pick up that uh, metal, bring it back to the ranch. Uh, wide. <laughs> Yeah, this is the stuff I cut out in my videos. <laughs> this is a special video. I'm going to leave everything in. This is in celebration of Brito. Everything 
the home of everything simulation. Look at that, man. I parked right up here. I get, I, I challenge any one of my co-creators to pull that off. Okay. Let's get in here. Let's get some metal. The unedited version. I mean, it'll be a little bit of editing if I have big pauses and gaps because my brain shuts down and I can't talk. I'm not going to leave that in there. That's stupid. We don't do stupid. We try not to anyway. We got, we got enough stupid stuff we do. We don't need to add to it. All right, so 50 of these are going to be 500. So, okay. All right, well, we got 2155. That's not bad. All right, I'll, I'll burn that 500. We need it. We still have cash down to 16. Not bad, but it's really not bad now. Now with the cows going, uh, we're in good shape. You know, we always have the oil. I sold a bunch of oil uh, before this episode as well. Sold this honey. And, uh, yeah, I think I made 4000 on the oil. I got four barrels. So right now, you go up there, it's probably maybe got a barrel. If it has a barrel. But it's somewhere around in that range. So it'll be another, let's see, this is day 22, so probably, what, day 23, 4, 5, day 26, I'll go up there and I'll grab four barrels of oil. And, uh, yeah, that's how that works. And, and I'll tell you, the honey is quicker, though. The bees produce faster, and you fill up 10, that's three grand. And you can fill up honey faster than the oil fills up. So I'm, a, I'm, I'm becoming a fan of the honey. So during my grind sessions, I'm out there uh, looking for the hives again. And I am cutting down the trees. You do have to cut down the trees. I, I, I asked that in one of my earlier videos, you know, when I first uh, encountered that. And uh, it absolutely is what you should do so that they respawn because they have been respawning. All right. Let's go ahead and I'm just going to park here. And, uh, you know, bring my metal. Look at all, look at the cows, man. Is that awesome? So here, look, we got six, right? So I got one of this color, one of this color, and one of this color. And I just repeated it. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. All right. Let's throw this in here. There's 50. And we've got that little stack. You know what I wish they would do in the game is let you like when you have those those stack when you break the metal if you if you could combine it, right? See these two, one's six and one's forty-two. Yeah, it'd be nice if you could you know combine it. I hope I don't sound like I'm getting a cold. I think I might be getting a cold. I'm hearing it right now as I talk, uh, so I apologize if I am sounding a bit nasally. I don't need to run all over creation. We'll just drop it right there. All right, let's get the chicken coop built. Here we go. And look, you know, you might as well go, in my opinion, go for the big one right off the bat. It's easier to get the eggs out. Uh, and it's only 100 planks and it's only 52 metal. And if you play the game with the oil well, you know, you get the access to the oil. Uh, you know, getting the metal is not a big deal. It's just, uh, you know, just waiting for a few days of uh, grinding, you know. You're going to be grinding anyway for stuff, wood, stuff like that. You might as well, uh, you know, get some uh, oil going early. Get a couple of barrels minimum. You know, a couple of barrels minimum. It'll, you know, it'll keep you in a little bit of money, help you get this metal, help you get these things built. And, uh, whoop, there we go. I thought I was going to, I thought I was going to have a no drop streak, but that's not going to happen. I think what it is is when I get home from work, my hands, because I'm on a computer all day, and I think my uh, hands forget my muscle memory here because I actually have this uh, insert remapped to my side mouse button. It's not E for me. Anyway, check it out. Much easier to deal with chickens with this thing, so it's definitely worth just going big or go home. You know? You're going to have chickens. Skip. Give them a nice pad, man. Plus, if you do want to come in from the side, you can do this, which is really nice. 
All right, next thing I want to do is we've got to get this all, we've got to get the, we've got to get the feeders going here. Let's grab a little wood here. Hey guys, guess what? It's raining in Ranch Simulator. What a surprise. And, uh, and you know, I saw, I think, I was watching, uh, I was watching Brito, he was doing the, uh, the farming. Which I haven't done yet, so I'm looking forward to that. And Brito, if you're watching this video, you, you better build that dairy setup that I made over there because I'm going to tell you something on that. my next playthrough, and there is going to be a, a, a third playthrough of this because I've actually gotten some better ideas. Uh, what do you see what the next dairy thing is going to look like? But uh, yeah, where was I? Oh yeah, we got we to gotta build the food here for these guys. But um, Brito was... I already built that. And look, it's already full. Yeah, awesome. Let's go ahead and get the fence built. Uh, Brito showed, like, let me show two in mine. Let's go to, to, to the uh, options. Gameplay. What's this say? It says enable lightning and storm. Enable lightning storm. Off. What's happening right now? I call this a lightning storm. Maybe not. That, yeah, yeah, there it was. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so much for the off. There is no off. <laughs> if there was an off, trust me, I would have it off. But anyway. And if you are a subscriber to my channel, and for some unfathomable reason you don't know who Brito is, the home of everything simulation is, uh, well then you need to get over there and you need to find out. You know, don't waste, don't waste time. Don't miss out. You'll be missing out on some great playthroughs, I'll tell you that much. I can learn a lot from the man. Let me see here, where's this going? Down here. Uh, I just want to get this in so that when we go get a couple of chickens, we don't have to worry about, you know, we don't have to worry. Why am I, why do I have this closed? It's not like there's animals in here. Come on, RP. Wise up. Wise up. Uh, got some really great comments from you guys. And by the way, guys, if you do like the uh, videos and you're enjoying the content, please do me a favor. I got to say this, sorry, but you got to hit the like button. The comments, which you've already been doing, are awesome. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, you know, I'm trying to make some nice videos for you. Trying to make, uh, trying to make some fun stuff here, and also, you know, some cool stuff, some stuff that uh, that works. I like Ranch Simulator. This, the, I love building. Number one, that's 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 the big thing. Is I love building. I'm a Virgo, so I'm very. Uh, what, what you call like uh, everything's got to be straight everything everything's got to you know a reason for everything everything's got to be orderly uh i'm a perfectionist to an annoyance and if you don't believe me ask anybody that's worked with me or my wife she's not home so i can say that and she stopped watching the videos a while ago <laughs> Anyway, no, I'm just joking. She watches them. Uh, there we go, guys. Check it out. And we got wood left over, which is awesome. There'll be an edit there. I had to clear my throat. And you're not gonna you're not gonna hear that nastiness. All right. All right, cool. There we go. Let's shut the gate to make it look the way it's supposed to look. And uh, what do you guys think? Think we go get some chickens? Huh? This is the unedited version, so you're gonna see everything everything maybe one or two little edits uh, i don't know all right first of all i might have to edit this me looking for my vehicle all right we got to get the uh we got to get this stuff out of here let's see if i can be uh smart drive it closer to the table not be running around yeah soon i'm gonna have to start uh uh putting the uh oil money into wood because we're gonna have to start uh getting a lot of wood and I don't want to strip any more wood off of the ranch and when I say wood I mean the trees you know I don't want to like I don't want to remove these trees over here and I don't want to remove the trees that surround us like a horseshoe like I said out there where we're going to be uh 
farming, I don't care. You know, because I'll be able to bring my equipment out there easier. It's, uh, it makes sense not to have trees going forward from this build, but it doesn't make sense to, you know, completely knock everything down and make it look barren. So, yeah, we won't be doing that. All right, so I think what we'll do is we'll get a few chickens and a rooster. And, uh, yeah, we'll start getting our eggs. Now, I found a... Uh, let me see if I can find it again. I found a... a yeah, right here. This is a quick little... Check this out. Huh? Is that nice? Nice little uh, shortcut. Nice and smooth. All right, let's put this here because these chickens are just going to be like scattered everywhere. All right, let's see. First of all, let's see how much they are. <laughs> like to get as many as I can. You know, get the eggs going as quick as I can. Let's see what... Uh, what are these bad boys? Oh, these are only 50 bucks. Heck yes. The only thing limiting us right now is is the space to uh, be able to hold them. Let's buy four and see how many we can get in the back of that truck. And then if I can get some more in, I'll come back in here and I'll buy some more. So I hope everybody had a good day today. Uh, it's starting to warm up here in Boston. The snow that hit me is now starting to turn into slushy, sh crappy, uh, crappy stuff. You know, stuff you don't want. But tomorrow's supposed to be 50 around here, believe it or not. And uh, that should take care of that. That should melt everything. I think we can get, uh, how close can I get you dudes? I think we can get a few chickens. I think we can get a few chickens. Yeah. But anyway, guys, thank you for uh, letting me... <laughs> letting me be myself for the first part of the video. Uh, I really uh, do appreciate every single subscriber and every single view. Because for me, it's not monetary. For me, it's the subscribe, the like, and the comment says, Yeah, RP, please make another video. And that's all I want to do. That's all I want to do. That's all... All right, so hold on. Two. I think I can get two more. I think that's it. Yeah. Let's not get let's not get crazy. All right, let's uh let's get this. Get these. Yeah, definitely. Get these guys. These are our first chickens and I got to come get a I got to come back and get a rooster. I that's probably going to be the edit. All right? There's the edit. I'll come get the rooster. You guys don't we don't we don't need to go get the rooster together. I can do that. But yeah, here's all the chickens. And we're ready to go. All right, going to be a sweet spot here for you. There you go. I'll leave the gate down for you guys so you can uh you can think about an escape. Look at these guys, huh? <laughs> oh, this is a great way to end the day. Is build the uh chicken. Oh, 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 oh. Here we go. Let me get into my uh, my my proper view. And look at this. See, look nice and smooth. Come back down to the ranch. Hello. Here we are. Very good. Very very good. Yeah. So unfortunately, and you know, when I first did it and thought about it, I knew this one silo thing was a real real uh, iffy iffy thing. I didn't uh, really. I had about a 50% a feeling that it might work, but it, it won't. We're going to have to, probably this ranch will probably need that one that I blueprinted over there and that one that I blueprinted over there because I don't think the feeder, this one won't reach the very end of that left side of the pen, our camera left here. So let's go ahead and throw these guys into their new home you've got food you've got water got everything you need fellers there you go all right here we go leave the door open you guys come and go as you please enjoy welcome to rp ranch all I ask of you is just lay eggs that I can just quickly walk right up here and throw into these pots and get the the best 
uh, blue cheese that that uh, a ranch can make. Okay, so that's it, man. We are we are rocking and rolling. So what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm going to leave you guys for a second. And let's see. It is it's it's about what six o'clock. Six o'clock at night. And let's let's just check out how everything looks. I gotta slow down, you know, so that you guys can really see like how the build went. Got great comments I want to address. Everybody did some uh fantastic comments on these videos. I've got ideas for playthroughs uh because of the comments. I've got uh a nice challenge series that that we're going to uh, formulate and do, and uh, I'd actually like to talk to uh, Brito about that. That 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 this this suggestion I got I think is awesome, and I think Brito would love that as well, and I definitely want to share it with him. So I, I might I might reach out to Brito and uh, tell him about it and see what he thinks, and uh, yeah, I got a great uh, great idea for another series. And uh, so let's uh, let's just kind of chill right here because I want you guys to see the milking process and it's going to take like, you know, I need to I need to pause the video. I need to do a cut here and come back. But I but this is it. You know, it's just going to be a straight cut. I'll come back in the morning because I want to milk the cows for you. Maybe see what the what the chickens did. And I think that that'll be let me look at the time here. Yeah, that that's an unedited video. That's long enough. Be lucky if I can keep you guys watching it that long. I love you all. I'll be right back. All right, everybody, welcome back. It is the morning, and I just want to end this episode with, uh, you know, getting some milk, showing you guys how this works, thanking you once again for supporting this channel and for making it such a pleasure for me to make videos as I collect my milk. Is this awesome? <laughs> this works so nice, right? Hello, can I have yours? The only thing is, is sometimes it's a little tricky to uh, get it back. But that's why it's this height, so that we can jump down. I'm going to get rid of this. I don't have one of those compost bins yet. So I actually have to get rid of the poop the old-fashioned way. I don't know what you're doing when you're picking it up like this, but I hope it's not going into my pockets. But anyway, yeah, that's a lot of poop. Uh, so yeah, that's how the milking machines work. And uh, again, this was an unedited episode, so it it ran long enough. And in the next episode, we'll uh, let's go over here and check out the chickens. Now they lay lay eggs at four o'clock, uh, but I don't think they would have laid eggs on their first night here. They did lay poop. Of course, you know, so I'll pick up these brown eggs and we'll call it right here, guys. Thank you so much. Uh, in the next episode, got some more stuff to build. Got a barn to build over here. Got a pig facility to build. We've got a dairy facility to grow and dairy products to make and see how much we can profit. And finally, the sun. Thank you so much, sun, for showing up as I end my episode. Everybody, you know what I say. Happy ranching. Ta-ta and bye-bye.